Hey guys, on today's episode of Wristwatch Check, we are taking a look at one of the quirkiest vintage Cartier tanks. So let's keep this short and let's take a closer look at what makes this one of the weirdest Cartiers in the vintage market. So in vintage watch terms, the Cartier tank on my wrist today does count as a jumbo because from this era, Cartier tanks were mainly 23 millimeters for men's. But this example is a 25 millimeter because of its larger wood case. This example is fairly uncommon and rare. It's a love-hate relationship for most. Some people truly love it. Others just don't get it and think it's hideous. In my opinion, it is so cool because this shows how experimental Cartier was and how much they still are. Even looking at watches and wonders and looking at what Cartier is doing now. They have always had this experimental DNA in their blood. And today we get to take a look at what they were doing in the 1970s to be different from everybody else. So again, this is a 25 millimeter case, not a 23 millimeter like you would often see with the Cartiers from this era. Being from the 1970s, house inside is a manual at a movement. It's 25 millimeter case is paired with two separate pieces of wood on each side that could actually be taken off and are separate from the case itself. The dial itself is also made out of real wood with applied gold markers at 12, 3, 6, and 9, and then the Cartier applied under the 12. When it comes to affordable watches, Cartier from this era are known to be super popular. Looking at the Moose D Cartier line for well under $3,000, you can get yourself one of the most iconic watches in a silver case with a thick gold plating. But if you want something even more quirky and special, we take a look at the Cartier Tank Wood. This example is the Jumbo and there were two sizes, this and the 23 millimeter, but this is the more collectible example. Paired with a matching dark brown strap, I think this watch is one of the coolest examples of affordable Cartier. A manual one movement in a larger case for those people who love the Cartier tank but hate the size. On wrist, I think it actually wears pretty well. On my 7 inch wrist, which is a pretty common wrist size, you can see that the 25 millimeter case wears perfectly. And even for a larger wrist, this watch would wear just as good. Now, if your wrist was smaller, Cartier tank would look pretty jumbo on your wrist in this case size. But in my opinion, it's cool and it's different. It shows that Cartier was trying so many different things in this era. Take a look at their Moose D Cartier line with lapis lazuli dials and so on there is a lot that came out of Cartier in the 70s and this is one of them this watch is fairly rare and I remember just three years ago these watches were close to a thousand to a thousand five hundred dollars with the jumbo case and now they've jumped to be two thousand plus dollars and some of them in amazing condition with original strap and buckle and even box and paper examples are going for near five thousand dollars and I understand why when it comes to Cartier tanks it is not often that you find a 25 millimeter cased Cartier so for this example being one of those exceptions, you can understand why it is so collectible. And if this wood case is maybe a bit too much for you, they also did make an example with a lacquered wood dial and a regular gold Cartier case in 23 millimeters. And that might be something to look into. But again, this is totally different from the normal Cartiers that we see in the Neo Vintage, Vintage, and even modern side of Cartier. So this is a unique piece. This is for someone looking to add something truly special and unique in their collection. So if you're looking to purchase a watch as cool as this Cartier Tank Jumbo, take a look at the Vintage Watch Shop over at HuntingtonCompany.com because this is available for sale right now. And I don't think it'll last too long because of how rare it truly is. Thank you guys so much for checking out today's video and I will see you guys in the next one. Oh,